Hey guys, I just got done filming my top five hated items that are keto. By the way, good morning. This is Sunday. Happy Easter. Um, my battery is dying. I just wanted to do a quick intro before I put my battery on the charger. Uh, that's why I am finally dressed and hair done and everything because I had to film a video today. Um, I'm editing and I haven't eaten anything yet today and it's 12.24. I'm about to probably have an energy drink. Not in the mood for coffee lately. So I'm just going to have an energy drink and I'm not going to eat until I'm hungry. But I most definitely will try to record it if I do. Hopefully my battery will be charged by then. So we made some egg salad from the eggs from this morning and I'm all festive and stuff because my little spinach and herb tortillas are in a beautiful pastel green that match my eggs. And I just rolled my egg salad up in this. I'm going to have two of these. This is my first meal of the day. It is 1.10. I have not eaten anything yet. I have not drank anything yet. Didn't even make my energy drink. I do have some licorice spice stash here that I am going to have and that's it so far guys so for dinner i just decided that i was going to cook the uh meatloaf that i was going to cook yesterday but the meat was never thawed in time so i'm just recording on my iphone today because my battery is all the way upstairs and i don't feel like going to get it let me get this meat out let me get everything prepped and then i will show you how i make my meatloaf i have all of my ingredients that i'm going to mix together i have two pounds of ground beef i have like just a little bit of onion that i had in the refrigerator in here one cup of shredded mild cheddar cheese with a little bit of mozzarella just using up what i had one cup of almond flour i have about a teaspoon of garlic powder a teaspoon of salt a teaspoon of pepper and about two teaspoons of worcestershire sauce and um I'm gonna mix this all together. Oh, one egg as well. I'm gonna mix this all together until it's nice and firm. I don't like putting it into a loaf pan, so I'm actually just gonna cook it right here in this casserole dish. So I'm gonna do this. I have my oven preheated to 425, and I'll probably cook this for about 30 minutes. All right, so here is the meatloaf. I'm gonna throw this bad boy in. It's probably gonna be in there longer than 30 minutes. Probably, Josh was saying, probably about 40 minutes. That's probably correct. So I'm gonna put that in. Look at my teas. Aren't they pretty now? So I've been drinking teas. a lot of tea. Josh wants you to see his tea. There's Josh's teas. Oh my God. All right, so I'm gonna put this in and get it cooking. Alexa set a timer for 40 minutes. All right, so here's the meatloaf. It is perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect cut. You can see there's a big chunk of onion right there, but you can see it's cooked all the way through. 40 minutes, did it just beautifully. So this is for dinner made some corn for the kids. I'll probably have a side of egg salad actually with this because I don't have any other veggies and I can't have corn. So, all right, I'm gonna make up my plates and this is dinner and I am going to close out the vlog and I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope you guys had a great Easter. Hey guys, making pancake and I have some of the Birch Bender's pancake mix in here. I added a small scoop of the Keto Science Ketogenic Meal Shake for chocolate flavor. And then I added some of the Chalk Zero white chocolate chip baking chips. Please don't mind dirty dishes in the background. No, no dirty dishes. Anyways, <laughs> I have a cup of blueberry here that I have a scoop of the Keto Collagen. Only I have the vanilla in it. And then I have some pure and some heavy whipping cream. So I'm going to stir this up. I'm going to use my chaffle maker and I'm going to have some beautiful pancakes or waffles actually with some Chalk Zero maple syrup. I'll show you when I'm done. Good morning, everybody. Today is Monday. Um, I'm making those pancakes that you just saw. I woke up early. Well, not early. I guess I woke up at nine. I took a shower, brushed my hair, got dressed, cleaned the house. Now I'm making some waffles. We are supposed to have some insane winds today. Winds up to 55 miles per hour and um, they're expecting power outages. So hoping, crossing fingers, we don't... Excuse me, if you wanna go outside, then you just ask me. 
Don't push me. <sighs> Hoping our power doesn't go out. I'm gonna let Link out. I'm gonna finish making my waffles. I'm gonna get a little bit presentable because it really made me feel good yesterday. Just like feeling put together and like I had somewhere to go. <laughs> and uh, I highly recommend that. If you're, if you're struggling with the quarantine and you, even if you're somebody like me who isn't somebody who really enjoys to go out very often, if you just like wash, you know, take a shower, wash your hair, do your hair, do your makeup, get dressed up nice. Sometimes that helps. It helps you get out of that funk. It helps you feel a little bit better. Maybe get up early, do all your household chores, have breakfast, meal prep. And then if you play a game, you've got the rest of the day to play that game. Okay, my dog is pushing me. This is assault. I need to let him outside. So I was gonna do my makeup and then I decided I'm too lazy to do my makeup. And I just wanna eat my waffles and play my game. So that's what I'm gonna do. If that changes in the near future, you will see me with makeup on. So here is breakfast. It doesn't look so appetizing because two of them kind of fell apart. I think adding in the chocolate protein powder made them not want to live anymore, but they're all going to the same place, so. All right, so I totally lied about not putting on makeup. I was watching the collab videos with Aaron, Jess, and Ashley, and I just did my makeup, so. And I feel better. Today I used, um, remember that Unique Beauty? I used that on the eyes. And my favorite lip color ever is Christmas Cookie by Jeffree Star. I'm gonna die when I don't have any more left. And my hair is awfully curly today, isn't it? Look at all that. If, if only all of my hair could be this curly, like the curl's not frizzy, you know? That would be fantabulous. Anyway, sorry, I'm gonna play a game now. This is what I don't like about recording on my iPhone. I'm staring here and you can totally see that I'm not looking when in my camera, let me show you my camera. In my camera, I have the viewfinder. So I'm looking at the viewfinder and it looks like I'm looking directly at you guys. Here, I'm totally not looking at you guys because I'm so used to looking at myself. It's very hard to record and look at, at like a, just a spot, like there's nothing there. Anyways, 101 on cameras. All right, I'm headed to the grocery store just right across the street. I'm gonna get some veggies. I'm gonna make some fajitas tonight and I don't really have any veggies for myself and I'm really craving them. I'll wear my mask. So what I got was some heavy whipping cream. I got um, the crisp apple or the candy apple crisp bang and the birthday cake bang. I've never had that one. I got some spaghetti squash. I got a pack of the old Wisconsin turkey snack sticks. The raspberry too good and the mango hibiscus too good. I've never had those. Their quest bars were on sale for a dollar ninety-eight. I got the white chocolate raspberry and the birthday cake. I got a beautiful tomato. I got one. Uh, I got three ripe avocados and one not so ripe because I like to. I'm gonna make um, guacamole, but the not so ripe one I like to cut up and eat it. I got three limes. I got some baby bell. I got tricolored peppers. And I got some skirt steaks for fajitas because that's what I want to make for dinner tonight. It's really weird to record on your phone and then like you can't just flip it around. You have to stop the recording, do another recording. Anyways, um, I guess if I didn't have it facing towards me, but all is well. We are safe. We are home. The groceries have had ample time to defecticize. I don't know, that's not a word. Disinfect a size. Defect a size. I don't know. They've had ample time to disinfect. And I'm gonna have a baby bell. And I'm I, I don't know what's going on with the mail. I have the app that says when mail is coming and for days it's said that certain things were supposed to come and they've not shown up. So I don't know what's going on, where things are like my lollies granola, like um, my keto chow, like something from Yvette Sports, from all kinds of things. Um, the chargers for the kids' laptops so they can do schoolwork. All 
kinds of things are supposed to be arriving. Say that they're supposed to have arrived. My mom ordered me face masks and they were supposed to come a week ago. This is the biggest bowl in the world, but it's not that much. This is one avocado. I put um, two of the turkey snack sticks in here, a little bit of Parmesan cheese, some Caesar dressing, um, romaine lettuce, and some of the everything but the bagel seasoning, and some bacon bits somewhere in here. And this is lunch. I was sitting here and I'm playing my game and I got up to go look at the name of a brand of tortilla or something. I come back and this bro, this dude stole my spot and he won't get up. So now I have to sit on the floor and play my game. He's cold. It's a cold rainy day here, but I'm playing Animal Crossing and this animal crossed my path. It's gonna be dinner. Josh so graciously cooked this up for me with homemade seasoning. He chopped it and he cooked it and then i made some guacamole now i know this isn't the kind that you would normally see i like it chunky and i like it with a lot of lime so it's kind of just like mashed avocado with tomato and lime and salt but i like it that way so i oh my <laughs> that was not a person that was roseanne so i'm gonna make my plate and i'm gonna enjoy the rest of my nights and i will see you guys tomorrow bye guys